Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome to my channel with a brand new video of the Fortnite Ultimate FPS Boost Pack for low-end PC. And guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can increase your PC performance, especially into the Fortnite Chapter 3 after this new update. So guys, make sure to watch my this whole video because in this video, I'm gonna share with you some advanced settings. By using that, you can guys double the performance of your PC into the Fortnite. So guys, let's start over this video. So guys, first of all, what you need to do is you need to download this Fortnite Chapter 3 Ultimate FPS Boost Pack on your PC. Link available in the descriptions of my this video. So you need to simply go in the descriptions of my this video. Click on the download button and that will take you straight toward my this website. Once you are here, you need to go into this first article which you can check it out here. Fortnite Ultimate FPS Boost Pack for Low End PC. You can also find out this post under the chapter 3 section. So guys, now click here on this article. So once you click here, so it will take you on to the next page. Scroll all the way down, click on this download button. And now you are here. You need to click on the subscribe on YouTube. It will take you on my YouTube channel. Make sure you guys subscribe and turn on the bell notification. Because I'm gonna start uploading here a new content which you can guys also enjoy. So guys, once you subscribe to my this channel, now close out this tab. And guys, here this link will be automatically unlocked once you subscribe my channel. Now click here on this unlock link button. And guys, here your pack will be start downloading. Click on the start download button and download this pack on your PC. Once you download this pack on your PC, so guys, here is our this WinRAR or zip file. So simply right click here, click on the extract here and extract this folder on your desktop. Once you got this folder on your desktop on your PC, you need to open up this folder. There is a bunch of files. First is the delete all of the temporary and the useless file from your Windows to increasing the performance of your PC. So open up this first folder. Here is two files. First one is the delete log file and second one is the delete temporary file now simply double click here onto the delete log file from your computer and here it will start deleting all of the guys unused or temporary file from your pc it will just take few seconds so guys keep it running in your background so until now go for the next file which is the delete temporary file so again double click here and it will delete all of the temporary file now you need to press any key from your keyboard and it will close out this window here is the disk cleanup option. You can also all of the junk data from your computer. So double click here, select out your C drive or your Windows drive. Click OK. And here it will start calculating some data. So it will just take a few seconds. So here you will go this kind of window. And here is guys, you can check it out here. Windows update cleanup, Microsoft Defender data. And here is the size of guys this junk file. So now check mark here onto the windows update cleanup also check mark onto the wipe on microsoft defender antivirus here is the downloaded program files temporary internet file uh, windows error report and make sure to guys check mark onto the delete the directx shader cache here is the delivery optimization also check mark here and here is the language resources file check mark here and here is the recycle bin if there is no any important data in your recycle bin so guys simply check mark here and also check mark onto the temporary file now click here on this ok button delete file and delete all of this junk file from your computer it will also guys take some time to guys deleting all of this junk file according to the size now have a look on over this file and it is also completed now press any key from your keyboard and here we are done now go back into the previous folder or the main directory of our boost pack here is over registry files open up this file and guys make sure to install all of these files one by one on your pc first one for giving your processor the maximum performance for guys unlocking all the cores for the gaming so guys simply double click here click yes yes again click ok click on the cpu speed click yes click ok click ok again graphics for your gpu performance click ok for your memory for your ram for your gpu memory here it is for your network so simply double click here click yes click ok here is our last which is the ram speed so it will optimize your ram speed now once you're done now you need to simply go back into the previous folder here is the windows optimization file double click here and open up this folder first of all here is the background apps turn off you need to double click here it will take you directly here into the settings so you need to turn off all of the settings first of all 
Now scroll down and here is the background apps. Open up this option and click here on to the turn off. This will guys not delete this all application or program for your windows. It will just temporarily turn off from running this program in your background while you are using your PC or playing game on your low hand PC. So once you're done, now you need to simply close out it. Here is the disable FSO and the game bar. Double click here, click yes, click OK. Now go for the game mode and guys here is another most important thing make sure you guys turn on the game mode if you have the latest version of the windows update on your pc so i am using this one on my pc now close out it go for low latency for reducing your input delay double click here here we're done prevent unnecessary app from automatic starting double click here click yes click ok now go for the system performance property open up this windows settings and guys here is this window if you have a low-end pc so i suggest you to guys go with the adjust for the best performance but uh, because i am a content creator i am recording my video and i need best animation on my pc so therefore i am going with the let's window choose what best for my computer but i suggest you if you have a low-end pc and you are proper full-time gamer so i suggest you to go with the adjust for the best performance for getting more performance out of your pc in fortnite so once you apply the settings then hit apply and click ok now here is the windows 10 disable automatic up app update so guys again double click here here we done click yes disable telemetry click yes here is the windows 10 disable unnecessary services click yes here we are done with all, all the windows of 10 optimization now go back into the previous folder here is the program section here is guys two program first one is the path controller for unlocking all the cpu cores of your pc for gaming for more performance so how to use it i already guys have installed the software on my pc uh, so let's install it again double click here click yes click ok i agree all the term click next and install the software on your pc here is guys the interface so what you need to do you need to click on this drop down menu go for the bitsum high performance make it activate set all this option onto the disable and set all the slider onto the 100 percent then hit apply go for the bitsum dynamic boost enable check mark here go for this drop down select on the bitsum high performance click ok and guys here we are done you can also guys check mark on the show park setting in windows power plan therefore you can also check your settings in your windows power like if i go here in my power and sleep settings in additional power settings and here you will find out this option which is the bitsum uh, highest performance provided bitsum optimized cpu performance so here we have selected over this power plan now close out this power plan window close out the settings and once you guys done with all the settings you can check it out here over all eight of eight cores are active right now and it is working in our background so once you guys done i also recommend you guys update it onto the latest version new update is available so you can simply click here and update your software onto the latest version so guys once you update your park control onto the latest version so here our software is also updated now click ok and guys it will keep running in your background whenever you turn on your pc and give you the best performance so once you're done now go for the next software guys this software is best for some mad end to high end pc this is not best for the low end pc because it will reduce the performance of your uh, cpu of your game but i have a new guys a way by using it you can also get more fps in your low end pc into any game so double click here and open up the software you don't need to install the software on your pc so here is the interface so go for the three dots so now you need to go straight toward the directory which you have installed your fortnite so i have installed in my c drive program file epic game fortnite fortnite game binary win 4 and here is the guys all the launcher file of my fortnite so select out this first fortnite client win 64 shipping file you can also check it out here the size now click on this open button once it's selected here now you need to go for the select affinity so guys always leave the last core of your cpu for rest of your pc because if you don't leave it so guys you will get some problem like the lag or the strings in your game so therefore leave the last number of core from the software now i have eight so i'll go with the seven if you have four so go with three that will best for you so now click on the seven 
here is the shortcut name you can also change it like the run with affinity fortnite then here is the program uh, parameter just leave it here is the run you need to set it on the maximized then click here on this create shortcut click ok and guys here you will go to this kind of the shortcut of your windows on your desktop now you can directly run your fortnite by using this guy's shortcut for getting more performance so guys once you're done now you need to simply close out this folder go back in your boost pack go back into the main directory and here is our last folder which is the new res file which is the best resolution for your pc according to your pc build if you have a low end pc if you have a mad end pc or even if you have a high end pc this is the best resolution file or the fortnite config file for you so how do guys utilize it it's really simple like for example i have a mad end pc so i will open up this folder right click here copy this file and you need to go into this search icon or press windows r together from your keyboard or simply search here run then press enter now type your app data press enter go into this local folder epic game sorry go into this fortnite game save config windows client and simply paste it here and replace your file destination once you replace this file now guys simply one time restart your pc therefore all the registry changes which we have done on our pc that will take effect so simply restart your pc then launch your fortnite then you have some best settings in the fortnite and you will get more performance out of your pc so guys i hope so you love it so please make sure to drop a like on this video subscribe to my channel turn on the bell notification and leave your honest opinion about this video or this optimization in the comment sections so guys till at the next video peace out